Wolvendom. People from Mondstadt hardly ever come here. Even though it's not so far away from the city, the environment here is totally untouched. It's a wild place ruled by the laws of nature. It's survival of the fittest out here. Even the slimes around here are huge. Like those super duper massive ones over there. Do not worry. Uh, wolves, friends. But you are? We're just some boring old travelers passing through. <sighs> Don't smell boring. You smell... familiar. We smell? You smell like... Knights of Favonius. They are friends. I am Razor. I am no knight. Uh, oh! My wolf pack. They are my family. Your family? Yes. They raised me. We live together. We are family. So many questions. Mm, they are angry with me. I help you. Exposed our ambush. Boar ran away. Get our friend to catch you another boar. He's stronger than he looks. N no, no need. When knights try to help, wolves go hungry. Don't be silly. Wait here. We won't screw this up. Just watch. Ha ha! Told you we could do it. I... Thanks, but... Wolves catch five or six every hunt. Oh, tonight they go hungry. Uh, oh. Don't worry. You tried. At least you did better than other night friend. The red one. Bernie girl. If she was here, whole mountain is fire. Can't catch even one boar. I must go now. Here is not safe. Careful. Always watching. What a weirdo. Bernie girl? From the Knights of Favonius? What is he? Hmm. Who do you think it is? Hi, Paimon. Hi, Traveler. What can I do for you? Hi, Amber. Amber, do you know a wolf boy from Wolvendom? Who? He said you guys hit it off like a mountain on fire. What on earth are you talking about? Strange. He said he would wait for you at your regular spot. Did you lose your memory or something? My memory is fine. But you've been eating magic Matsutake again, haven't you, Paimon? I have no idea what you're talking about. Magic Matsutake? Hmm. Remind me what color they are? Purple. Paimon may have had a couple the other day. But that's not the point. Paimon's not loopy. Do you really not know that boy that lives with the wolves? I don't know what you're talking about. But on the subject of wolves, I've been investigating something recently. In the past, the wolves never dared venture outside of Wolvendom, 
But now they're getting braver. I heard they attacked a cart fleet near Drunkard Gorge. If you have time, could you come and check out the situation with me? Awesome! I knew I could count on you. Let's go! Look, up ahead! Something's happening! That ain't no wolf pack. Looks like it's the hilly trails attacking the carts after all. Huh. Not such a mystery after all. Enough talk. Let's go help out. Bless you. Piece of cake! So, the hilly trolls have been starting to flex their muscles on the back of the wolf scare. That's right. But I must say, if you think the hilly trolls are a nasty lot, the wolves are even worse. They... they attacked Springvale this morning. Springvale? That's crazy! It's unheard of. I thought I would take my chances on the road after the wolves had their fun. I never thought the hilly churls would show up too. We should head there soon and see how bad the situation is. But first things first, you should assess the damage to your cart. Does it still work? I'll take a look. Oh dear. This is awful. Poor lad can't even stand. That's terrible. Except he's not actually injured. Right. It's awful. The wolves frighten him so badly that he's paralyzed with fear. That really is awful. Do you remember any significant details of what you saw? I... I've never seen a wolf in my life before today. It was terrifying. No details then, huh? Let's investigate the area again. These claw marks... From them, we can tell the number and size of the wolves. This time, there were at least two wolves. And they must be... Yes, yes. They must be at least two meters high. Hey, wolves are mysterious creatures. It's not like you see them every day. This is a wolf's tooth. He must have smashed into the door when he pounced. Uh, anyway... Seems pretty lucky how no one in the village got seriously injured. Wolfer... I heard that in Liyue, they make calligraphy brushes out of this stuff. The color looks nothing like Mondstadt Wolfer, based on what the books say. Could it be that they're from somewhere else entirely? Hair looks different at every place on the body. Same applies to wolves. You don't know where it's from. But look at this. Another hair. But what's that stuck to it? It's the seed of a wolf hookberry. Look, there are little hooks on the seed. The only places this grows in Mondstadt are Wolvendom and Bright Crown Canyon. So it's Wolvendom wolves after all? From that area, yes, but it could be that there are other wolf packs encroaching on their territory. This doesn't tell us everything, but it does give us a strong lead, enough to start investigating. I'll go and see to the villagers before we head off. How is your investigation coming along? What? You're standing! Yes, I see. I have recovered, thankfully. I managed to claw my way back out of the depths of hell. So, Knights of Favonius, what have you found out? From inspecting the wolf fur left at the scene, we can tell that the wolves came from Wolvendom. Beyond that, we don't know anything. But please remain calm. I will head to Wolvendom shortly and get to the bottom of this. The Knights of Favonius will not allow this danger to continue any longer. Good. Better late than never, I suppose. How rude! In the meantime, we'll just have to keep dealing with this on our own. Please, don't do anything stupid. <laughs> we do things a bit differently around here. You Favonius lot probably aren't used to it. They will pay for what they've done. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. It's awful. Really is. What is? Their future outlook, I mean. 
Young people can be so impulsive sometimes. If it's not too much to ask, I hope you can keep an eye on them. Stop them from getting into trouble. It's no trouble. That's what we're here for. Even though that guy really isn't much of a charmer. Leave it to us. Uh, off to Wolvendom we go. Who's there? Chill out, Razor. It's only us. You are also Knight? So you don't know each other after all? No. This girl also red, but not so Bernie like other girl. This is starting to make sense. Is this the wolf boy you were talking about? Correct. His name is Razor. Help me out. With what? No time. I sent Lupa call away. People coming. Bad people. Those guys from earlier? I understand, but first, I have a few questions. I smell blood. Quick! Blood? I hope the wolves didn't attack those idiots. Blood droplets? Not human blood. Wolf blood. Lupa call blood. Lupa what now? Are you gonna tell us what it means yet? Lupa call is family fate gave me. When wolf accepts human as its own, or human accepts wolf, that is Lupa call. Sounds like gibberish to me. That's strange. Where does the word come from? Surely it wasn't made up by the wolves. It's just the name he gave. Who's he? Guardian of this land. Wouldn't that be Barbados, though? He is the ruler of Mondstadt. Enough! Another clue. Follow me. Hey, wait! This is your chance to prove your innocence! <sighs> He's already gone. This is him. We find his blood. Bad men did this. Oh, how terrible! I do agree that it's awful, but that doesn't change the fact that... We didn't attack village! Not us! A black wolf and his pack, not from here. They tried to take over land. They broke the code. Whose code? Guardian of this land. That's now the second time you've brought that up. Tell us who that is. I take Lupa call further in. Follow me. Maybe you see. Help me. Collect these. Aren't those wolf hook seeds? Crush them. Put on wound. Bleeding stop. It's true. Wolf hook seeds have a liquid coating that not only functions as a mild painkiller, but also has a hemostatic effect. I read that in a book. Why? I have no idea. Hooks help seeds move. Liquid stops pain and bleeding. Animal doesn't feel hooks. They take seeds far away. Purple teacher told me so. I stay here. Take care of this one. I answer Red Girl's questions. Right. And if that lot does come back, I doubt they will try their luck against a member of the Knights of Favonius. Your wolf friend is not clear of my suspicion just yet, but we'll still need to fetch those seeds. We're back! Have we got enough? Yes. Enough. Razor was just telling me about the Wolven Code of Conduct. Mind-blowing stuff. Thank you. We've looked everywhere and haven't seen any other wolves. Yep, that's wolves for you. The one we managed to capture must have been brain damaged or something. What are you doing here? Revenge! It's him! The one who was raised by wolves! Huh? So, it was you! I should have known wolves aren't smart enough to be behind this. 
I can't believe you would help wolves plot against humans. They throw you some scraps and you treat them like kin? Have you forgotten what you are? Enough! Yeah! You can't talk about Razor like that! The Knights of Favonius are gonna let this guy off? We did not raid village. It's just like he said. An outside wolf pack coming in and breaking the rules. They will reap what they have sown. But Razor, you must not get involved. This is for the wolves to settle between themselves. You fight not with claws, but with the sword. You strike not with teeth, but with lightning. You are human, Razor. I am not like them. I don't belong. You are no wolf. This is a matter for the wolves, and the wolves alone. Hmm. And you... You are Razor's Lupacar amongst humans. Your nobility stands out against others of your kind. If you ever wish, you may train with me. I have nothing further to say. May we meet again, Razor and company. Hey, Razor, what's that look for? Why don't you come to the city for a few days? Yeah, you have a friend in Mondstadt anyway, right? You know, that red... Bernie friend of yours? You're not safe in the wild anymore, but I know that you don't want to hurt them. I'm fine, don't worry, but I'm not city human, but also not wolf. Thank you, Traveler, Paimon, and other red girl. Hey, we've been with you all this time, and you still don't even know my name? Goodbye. <laughs>